Resound, O cry of victory! All right. We can't seem to find our way through this forest at all. Oh, could this be the curse? What should we do, Yuri? There really was a curse after all. Don't be stupid. Or, do you not have a good sense of direction? No, of course I do. I think. Then maybe it's my fault. What should we do? They say no medicine can cure a fool, but I wish something could cure a bad sense of direction. <laughs> It'll be a hundred years before you can beat me. Because you've lived a lot longer, right? Not exactly. Is this kid for real? It's all right now. Huh? The monster turned into a girl? Oh, brother. This should be interesting. I'm Carol Capel. I'm a member of the Hunting Blades Guild. We travel the globe in search of the toughest monsters. I'm Yuri. This is Estelle. And you've met Repeat already. Anyway, nice to meet you. What? Yuri, wait! My apologies. Huh? Hey, wait up! Where are you guys going? You guys are here to enter the woods, right? Well then, I'll... Actually, we've just finished coming through the woods and we're on our way to Halur. No way! You guys made it through the cursed woods? Did you guys run into any egg bears? Do you know what he's talking about, Yuri? Nope. I don't think we've seen any. Man, I wonder if I should head back to town then. They definitely won't like it if I keep them waiting. All right. I'm not sure you two would make it on your own, but never fear! The star member of the Hunting Blades will be your escort! See that? I've even got my own Blastia! What? You guys both have one too? Uh, uh, oh yeah? Whoa, how do you like this? It 
It has information about monsters. Hmm? After a certain point, all the pages are blank. That's because I'm going to fill it up with piles of monsters after this. Hey, wait! Who said you could just write in there? It might hurt your star member status if it got out that you broke your sword. Oh, that? I had to give myself some kind of handicap or else it wouldn't have been a fair fight. Hey, that's actually not too bad. Yo! Do you guys even know where you're going? Halora's to the north once you get out of the woods! Come on, guys! Wait for me! Having friends to talk to really makes traveling a lot more fun. When I'm by myself, I get a little scared. Uh, I mean bored. Yeah, uh-huh. Hey, Carol, there's a monster behind you. What? Oh, my mistake. I must be seeing things. D don't do that! Our trip just got more lively. <laughs> Strong, do we even have a chance? Yo! Holy power, Yo! come to me! Yo! First <laughs> Holy power, come to me! Yo! Yo! through my Hello, the city of blossoms. Yeah, that's right. Don't they have a barrier here? Yes, there should be. You guys haven't been to Halur before, right? So then you haven't heard about the tree barrier. Tree barrier? Some Blastia fuse to plant life, gain organic qualities, and evolve. The Tree Barrier of Halor is one prime example of this. I read that in a book. Well, thank you, Professor. So what's happened to this famous barrier? Doesn't look like it's doing much right now. 
every year, just before the blossoms are in full bloom, the barrier weakens for a while. It's just that time of year right now, and the monsters took the opportunity to attack. Is that when the barrier went down? Yeah, the monsters were taken care of, but the tree is slowly starting to decay. Hey! Well, what is it? Sorry, I gotta run! Bye! Does that kid ever sit still? So I guess you'll be looking for Flynn now, huh, Estelle? <sighs> Doesn't she know we need to keep a low profile? And what happened to looking for Flynn? your wounds oh my you can use healing arts why that would be excellent but I'm afraid we don't have very much money no no I don't need any money amazing the pain is all gone thank you thank you so very much uh, uh, please don't mention it my heavens what amazing healing arts you have how can we ever thank you? No, really. Think nothing of it. What a humble young lady. I wish the Imperial Knights could follow your example. Not a chance. The Knights refuse to lift a finger to protect us from the monsters. Well, I guess the Empire couldn't care less what happens to us here. No, th that's not true. Ah, but that one knight sure was different, wasn't he? Yes, that young man. If not for him, we would have all been lost. The barrier weakened earlier than usual this year, and we were attacked before the guild could come to protect us. There was a knight who happened to be passing through our town on a pilgrimage. He and his brigade drove off all the monsters. A knight on a pilgrimage? Was this knight named Flynn by any chance? Yes, his name was Flynn Shifo. Is he still in the city? No, 
he left the village afterwards in search of a mage who could fix the barrier. You know where he went? It looked like he was headed east, but beyond that I couldn't tell you. I see. So we can wait here, and Flynn will come to us. Looks like we've caught up with him. Don't you feel better now? Yes. I won't be able to relax until I see him. I guess I feel better. I think I'll go have a look at this famous tree. Want to come with? Ah, yes. Yuri, you don't mind? You're okay not going after the Blastia core thief? I can spare enough time to look at a tree at least. This Carol guy is kind of weird. He does seem a bit restless, but that doesn't make him a bad person. He didn't seem evil. But I'll bet he's got some weird thoughts going on in his head. You're only saying that because you can see some of yourself in him. You think the two of us are alike? Yes. It's like you have genuine emotions, but your pride won't let you show them. So I can't bring myself to dislike him. Huh. <laughs> Did I upset you? No, that's just some pretty deep insight about people you only just met is all. Hey! person and none of the others from the guild are here either I kept her waiting so long she must have gotten mad and left I wanted to show her Halur's flowers in full bloom then maybe Carol what's the matter where'd she go is she really gone I'm doing the best I can Carol let's give him some time alone it's over it's over it's all over it's really over. Everything, everything is over. Yeah! We got weapons now! We're gonna beat those monsters! The mayor's gonna let us fight now! Let's beat up those monsters just like Flan! Yeah! Even those kids are trying to fight. I hope the barrier is restored soon. Me too. Even though Daydenhold was struggling without a barrier, they'd have had issues even with one. Yes, barriers really do have a big impact on people's day-to-day -day lives. Well, they keep people safe from monsters just by being there. It's no surprise it changes things. I want to help heal Halur's tree as soon as possible so that everyone can feel safe again. It's huge up close. The tree's flowers should blossom any day now. Yeah, I wish I could see it in bloom. I know how you feel. There's something about the image of a tall tree vibrant with blossoms and protecting the city that's so... romantic. You know, I'm gonna stay here and help heal the injured. Hmm. If you're gonna heal something, maybe you could heal the barrier itself. What do you mean? When monsters come again, more people are gonna get hurt. Those kids we just saw could be among them. That's true. But I have no idea how I could heal the barrier. What you need to heal is this tree. It wouldn't be in this condition just because some monsters attacked it. You think there's some other reason? I think there's gotta be. What are the two of you doing over here? We're trying to figure out why the tree has withered like this. I don't know if you'll make much progress on that one, 
The Knight Flynn couldn't figure out the reason either. Oh, Carol! Carol, we need your help! What are you talking about? It seems these two are trying to figure out the reason the trees withered so. Oh, is that all? What do you mean, is that all? I know the reason. It's why I was in the forest looking for the egg bear. Huh? What are you talking about? Look closely at the ground. Notice the strange color? That color is where the ground absorbed the blood of monsters who attacked the town. That blood has been poisoning Halur's tree. What? The monster blood? I had no idea. Carol, you really know your stuff, don't you? It was nothing. Is there anything we can do to get rid of the poison? I know a way, but... Well, no one believes me. Come on, try us. I think we'd be able to do it if we had a panacea bottle. Maybe we can get one in the general store. Let's go, Yuri. I can't wait until the tree's blossoms are in full bloom. They'll be fantastic. I bet there's a flood of petals big enough to just sweep you away. All those petals dancing in the breeze. It'd be like a dream. I wonder how they deal with all their houses getting buried in flowers every year. It's gotta be a pain to clean up. You really take the fun out of things, Yuri. Welcome to the store. What can I get for you today? Do you have any panacea bottles? Unfortunately, we're sold out at the moment. But how can that be? Well, you know, if I had the right ingredients, I'd be able to fix them up for you. What would you need to make it? I'd need three ingredients. Egg bear claw, nea fruit, and Leluria petal. But why do you need a panacea bottle so badly? A kid came by the other day asking about the same exact thing. You want to heal Halur's tree. What's that? I've never heard of using a panacea bottle on a tree before. Hmm, yeah. What sort of thing is the Nia fruit you mentioned? That would be the bitter fruit you said was so delicious back in the woods. So, what's an egg bear then? Sorry, I can't help you there. Monsters are beyond my expertise. If a member of the Hunting Blades were here, they might be able to tell you. They make their living hunting monsters. So that's why he was in the forest. What can you tell us about the Leluria petal? You know the tree in the middle of town, right? It's a petal from that tree. Normally, we use magic resin, but there isn't any around these parts at all. But the tree is all withered. I believe the mayor has some Leluria petals. You might try asking him. Gotcha. We'll come back when we've gotten the ingredients together.
Come on, Carol. We're going back to the Koi Woods. What do you mean? Remember? Prepare to die, Egg Bear! You mean you believe what I said about the Panacea Bottle? Are you lying? Well then, we'll have to go with what you've told us. Yuri! Alright, I'll help you out just this once. I'm a very busy person, you know. It's settled then. The three of us will restore the barrier together. You're coming too, Estelle? Well, of course I am. What about waiting for Flynn? Wasn't it you who said if you're going to heal something, it should be the tree? We'll just have to fix the tree before he gets back. <laughs> Can't wait to see the look on his face. Estelle, what are you looking at? It's a map of the area around here. Oh, let me see. Hey, this is almost completely blank. You can't call this a map. Really? You should try a surveyor's guild like the World Cellar. Their maps are really amazing. All the top guild members have one. So then naturally you've got a copy, right, Carol? Let's see it. Uh, well, you see, once you get as good as I am, you don't need to use a map anymore. Oh, that's too bad. I really wanted to see it.